Hello, Arc Matter here, and welcome to the show. Guess what? I am going to talk about tablets and a little bit more. Um, first, let's get the shout-outs out of the way. Three Geeks Network, make sure you check them guys out. Mike McGee, make sure you check his channel out. These are great people. They have a great podcast, and that's why you need to see them. They just talk about some pretty cool stuff, movie reviews, you name it. Uh, Nerdbot Media for all your Nerdbot stuff. Make sure you check them out. They're on social media all over the place. Check them out. Nerdbot Girls, too. They're there. Uh, also, AMJ Productions, local YouTuber, young guy, great person. He does some really cool stuff, like I always say. Power Cosplay Powers. Make sure you check out Cosplay Powers. Give your cosplay powers. Check them out on Instagram. Send your picture in. Get Cosplay Powers. And unless you check them at a local con or something, you get powers. And the last thing, but not least, XDA for tablet information or whatever you need for just crazy modding stuff I guess but make sure you check out the XDA uh, join the forums join their groups great bunch of people there they will help you out um, run into really some great people on the XDA over the times that I was doing all the trio tablet stuff so anyhow why are we here so I'm gonna try to keep this under five minutes if I can if I go over a little bit I apologize but what you're gonna need is a flash drive Sorry, I'm still trying to learn how to get my phone to stop adjusting so much, but you'll get the gist of it. OGT, something from OGT to do OGT. I don't care, I have two things for OGT sitting here that you can connect to. I don't know what that's doing. That's the HDMI cable thing, but that's HDMI. To, <laughs> I don't know how that got in my, got stuck with the stuff I was carrying in here, I guess. And a keyboard. This is my Logitech uh, wireless keyboard. I love these things. They're very inexpensive they last on the batteries forever I use them with all my Raspberry Pi stuff my tablet stuff when I'm doing it it's controlling my Android um, stream box right now I can sit all the way back from the couch and it, the beats the remote to death that it came with so um, essential to what we're gonna do if you know if you get lost on this but anyhow Windows uh, you go to the USA uh, Next Book uh, page and download the software um, image, and you'll get the converter in there too if you want to convert the image to put into so you can put it on your flash drive or SD card. This is on a flash drive, and then I just plugged it into my OGD connector that goes into my tablet to do an image run on this. Now I have two um, tablets here. And the main reason why I want to do this, I've, I've only seen one video. Now there's tons of videos on YouTube, tons of tutorials. And I was reading a lot of forums and I could not figure out. I bought these two at a garage sale pretty cheap because the guy was like, they don't work. So just like whatever. So I paid for them and I got them at a decent price because of them being locked. So I kept looking at all the videos and some of the forum stuff and I kept coming up with, I seen one guy do it and then I don't remember his name. So I apologize. Uh, but he took the OGT and he put it in, booted it up, and went right to the image and re reset the whole tablet off the image. And it came up with some stuff to do the EFI and all that other stuff, I think. Uh, I did, that didn't happen with me. I couldn't really get these tablets to do anything. They just kept looping. It's called, the, you know, the 8.1 loop or whatever. It keeps looping and looping and looping. Well, one of these has a cracked screen and one doesn't. But... You know, I wanted to flip them to get my kid something else and have a little extra cash. So I thought, well, if I got him and he gave them to me cheap, I could flip them and get them running. I, for a week, I couldn't figure out, even on the forums. I'm like, how do I get it to be to boot up? But because I kept getting the one where you hold the up power up down, I got that. I'd done a lot of the Android tablets over and over again. Your power up and or down, and you wait for it to boot. So I was like, dang! I kept trying all these different combinations to get. The tablet to work to OGT to do the image to do it to flash it and I don't want to reflash it but I just was showing you the tools that I have that I use to get to it but what I figured out was power and the windows I don't think it's I don't want to zoom in onto it uh, power I held on to the power and I held on to the windows home up here I held on to these two buttons maybe for three minutes max two minutes at the most, three minutes max. It booted up off the OGT and then rebooted the image and the tablets work great now. 
Uh, see if I can get these to come up. It might be dead again because oh, there's one. So see, it's coming up. So I just want to show you that I reset it. And I think this one's backwards. Uh, but uh, let's see if I can get these both to boot up real quick for a minute to show you. You coming on there, little guy? There you go. So anyhow, here's the two net netbook tablets that were stuck in. They were stuck in 8.1 loop. And that 8.1 loop drives me nuts. Uh, so and now it's just act asking to activate Windows. But it's cool because these are next books and it's already put into the image to the tablet. And so they're already keyed to come up. But you can see right here, it's it's this is the one with the cracked screen. So it kind of just jumps around all over. I can't get it to... I got to be really careful. Where'd it go? Where'd you go, the little arrow? Get over here. So anyhow, you can see this one's asking me to go ahead and set up the region and everything. Uh, I sold these, so I'm not going to touch anything. And they can activate the windows themselves. Uh, there we go. So, it's it's coming up. Ba, 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 ba. See, it's already right there. There's the key, the piece of the key right there already, so that's fine. Hopefully it'll still pick my Wi-Fi up because I was I was trying to clear them all up and get them clean. So yeah, we'll try it again later. Um, so there you go. So the secret was for me, um, it was the power and the Windows Home power and the Windows Home hold together and boot straight to the OGT um, image file which I had on my flash drive or you can use an SD card, whatever you want, whatever you want to do. But that's how I got mine to work. Because it was driving me nuts no matter how many times I tried. So, please like, please subscribe. Uh, thanks for hanging out with me. This was a, a ne ne next book. A point, what the heck was this model number? Anyhow, I can't remember. Um, the, well, the model number is the serial number. was the YFG09141974. And it was the model, I think it was the model NXYWBOC. Is that that BOC? I can't remember. Uh... A little bit not enough light in my room, sorry. <laughs> but I'll put the model number in my description of what I used and stuff too. So please like, please subscribe. Like I said, hey, thanks for hanging out with me. Uh, and this was one of those things that drove me nuts for a long time. And all the stuff on the forum kept saying, use the Android way to reset it. But they, you can't on these for the Windows. They were uh, power and Windows home button on the side and boom, and there you go. So have a great rest of the weekend and thanks for watching.